Hey everyone, it's Justin. Thank you for watching and welcome to my house. That's Justin's house. In this video, I'm showing you a new Tokyo feature for exporting your project status reports to PowerPoint. I can't tell you, I've been in the partner ecosystem for a few years now and how many people want to take that project status report and put it in something else, make it more executive friendly, make it more organization business friendly. Well, now you can with Tokyo. There's a plugin to export your project status reports to PowerPoint. I'm gonna go ahead over to the status reports. I've already got one made up here so you don't have to see me fill this out. But this is what we were used to seeing for project status reports. And what's new, if you activate the plugin and you do the configuration that's needed in Office 365 to get this to work as an add-in, you get a new button here to export to PowerPoint. Now you can have several different templates. I'm using the default template that ServiceNow provides out of the box. But if you have a look and feel that you need for your organization, you can make your own template and do that. I won't go into that here. It's on the documentation site. You're going to see when I open this PowerPoint that if you've ever in your life seen a ServiceNow presentation, it looks a lot like a ServiceNow presentation. Same kind of font and arrangements on particular slides. Now, what I tried to do in this one is make sure there was an actual, some actual data there for you to see how this would actually look once it's exported to a PowerPoint. So we've got our title slide, obviously we can change that. The project overview, I actually like the way this looks and feels, it's pretty nice. Um, I've got the details, I've got the project manager, let me put this in full screen mode so you can see it, there There we go. The state, the phase, the percent complete, I didn't bother putting any task in here, um, but if those tasks were open or if some were complete, we'd see a percent, percent complete. I've got some costs, plan cost, actual cost, and all my dates associated with that, oops. I've got the status summary. So here on the left, I've got the executive summary. We're letting the CEO know there or the CIO, whomever, know that we are on target to complete. Um, and here in the last week's achievements, this is interesting. I put a bulleted list in my status report. So that showed up not quite bullety um, for the way I wanted it. But here's what's cool is this is PowerPoint. So once it's in here, I can go and do what I want. So if I wanted to change these last three things to the bullets that were supposed to be there, I can put in those bullets and make those modifications. So that's the key thing here, right? So we're taking information from ServiceNow that we use every day and putting it in a format where we can do some tidying up and some tailoring of what shows there. Over here, we've got the key activities plans for some yoga sessions, some mindful sessions, maybe a meeting or two, and they might actually be at the plugin. Um, here I've got a graphic around plan costs versus actual costs. I made sure the data in there, you could see that. I've got my resource allocations versus actuals. I don't have any actuals in my particular project. Key milestones, the top five. So I've got at the top some pending milestones, at the bottom some completed milestones. I've got a slide for my risks. So here we see Abraham doesn't know. Uh, he might not be around at the end of the project. That's not that's not good. Um, and it's assigned to him. And I've got something completed around there are no risks that can be that can be true. Um, so some good stuff there. An issue page. Um, Abraham didn't know how to sign into service now. Uh, I've got some decisions. There was a change order approved, um, or we need a change order approved, and we want to establish a new go live date. Um, here I've got some actions. We need to create a status report and export it to PowerPoint. Um, and Able Tutor is going to train Abraham Lincoln on how to access ServiceNow. That's been completed, so we're in the clear there on that issue. Um, that's the request changes. So I've gone through all of those. Oh, no, request changes. I didn't cover that. So this one's pending to modify the scope. And then there's a completed one for Able whose resource plan needs to change. And they want to change something. Appendix. So the appendix is not showing the top five of the things you just saw. So it's going to list all of the key milestones there, all of the risks, all of the issues, all of the decisions, all of the actions, all of the changes. If you know ServiceNow, we've referred to that as RIDAC. Um, so that's your RIDAC components in your PowerPoint that we exported from ServiceNow. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please like, please subscribe, or share it with somebody who you think might be interested in getting their status report from within ServiceNow out into a presentation or a slide deck to share with their organization and share with their executive team. Until next time, don't forget to always be learning.